The race of crusades made way for many people, including beggars and peasants, to be able to join knights and counts in a giant fight for the Holy Land. Come follow me, for I have word from the heaven, a letter from the north himself. In the time there was this charismatic monk that began to gather an army of his own. He was known as Peter the Hermit. There is a letter I have, a letter that states the Lord orders for all Muslims, Islamists, who have taken the Holy Land away from us, which would be rightfully ours to visit any time, back. Let us go. Capture. And Peter the Hermit preached from town to town in his journey to recover the Holy Land of Jerusalem. And gain followers he did by twisting people's strong belief in love and turning them into thoughts of hatred and aggression, desecrating their religion. And he began his long trip from Bury in France to the east at Constantinople. And in the way he fought with anyone who interfered with him. Jews, Hungarians, and even Christians. But because of Peter's poor ability to lead, there was plundering and destruction okay. along their way. Peter finally arrived back to Constantinople, almost starving and tiresome of his long trip. He was hoping for the emperor to receive him with great gifts and food and water. But the emperor didn't. But Alexis, my men came to aid you in this holy battle. How could you take this kind of privilege from me, from my men? Uh, where was I? Oh yes, because the emperor didn't want Peter and all his followers inside Constantinople because he thought that they would make a mess inside. He sent them all over the street. They had reached Nicomedia when he decided he couldn't discipline his people and searched for advice from Alexius. They raided Walter the penniless camp killing all his men and leaving a fraction of Peter's men alive. This is terrible. Lord, praise my men, for they are in need of you. They suffered terribly from the Turkish raid. Aid my men for the fight for the Holy Land, for your fight. But God didn't help them, finishing the popular crusade. As for Peter himself, he waited for the other armies to come and went again to try to recover the Holy Land, but later renounced. He was captured later, but he begged forgiveness for his loss of faith, and accepted being the owner of the Christian army in 1099, and in 1100 went back to Europe, where he founded a monastery and became the prior of it.